Conveyor tests conducted on a full-scale operational conveyor belt as witnessed by BSI. ICAT's conveyor belt suppression system consists of two systems, that is, primary and secondary suppression systems. Primary risk areas, herein referred to as primary suppression, consist of three subsystems to suppress head or drive, tail and take-up areas. Secondary risk areas consist of belt suppression along the length of the belt to suppress product or belt fires, which are considered dynamic, moving fires. Combined, the primary and secondary systems are collectively capable of suppressing fires on complete conveyor belt installations. The system's methodology is focused on creating a water mist environment that leads to gradual cooling without causing thermal shock to equipment, thereby preventing reignition of the fire. The system's water mist technology allows for aggressive flame knockdown while displacing oxygen. The system consists of dynamic fire detection, that is the IR3 flame detector as well as the ember flame detector that is highly effective due to the high speed of detection and suppression against the belt speed and actuation times. Other detection technologies are employed based on environmental conditions and product being conveyed. The system's drive section, also referred to as head section, is regarded as the highest risk on a conveyor belt due to seizing component, insufficient tension of the belt, incorrect lubrication, and friction causing equipment to overheat. All primary detection sections are focused on detection of different areas with linear heat detection tubing and an optional optical flame detector. In the drive suppression section, the system is focused on suppression of the panhepton fire with a heat release rate of 3.2 megawatt fire that can rapidly spread to different areas. ICAC conveyor suppression system witnessed by BSI have been tested utilizing heptane, one of the most combustible liquids with an auto-ignition temperature of 200 degrees Celsius, less than commercial grade petrol. Also tested in two scenarios, namely flammable product, which is coal, and flammable belting with non-flammable product. The risk of coal product igniting due to spontaneous combustion causes a progressive fire that when moving at a high speed will be detrimental to productions and human life. The heat release rate is equivalent to 3.2 megawatt. ICAT specialization in world-leading fire suppression technologies have been tested in various high-risk scenarios and proven effective to mitigate associated fire risks. ICAT, change that doesn't cost the earth.